Today's video, I just wanted to share with you what the inside of a water heater looks like. If you go to my channel, you'll see that I have a video showing uh, how to flush your water heater. And I kind of want to give you an idea of what eventually happens after years of buildup and what the inside of your water heater looks like. And so here, this is the inside of the water heater. And you kind of see all of that buildup and deposit that's basically worked its way to the bottom of the water heater. This is all the sediment calcium buildup that affects your appliances uh, when you take a shower, if you're drinking your water. This is what's at the bottom of your water heater. And this is what causes all the corrosion uh, that eventually leads to your water heater starting to rust and leak. See here on the back, eventually all of that starts to eat away at the metal and then will start to rust over and cause a leak. So here you can kind of see some of the things I'm pulling out. talk about sediment this is just me barely grabbing the surface of what's at the bottom of the water heater you can see here this is the back of the water here the seam and you can see the rust has just started to eat through it there's more of what's on the side of the water heater Just wanted to share with you this is kind of the side wall of the water heater you can see all of the sediments not only at the bottom it goes all the way to the top as well and this is why flushing your water heater is so important because it removes all of the sediment from the side of the walls of your water heater the old nozzle that would allow for you to drain your water heater. And what happens oftentimes is after just years of buildup, you go to open your water heater and you try to drain it and it doesn't want to drain. Reason is because of all of this sediment right here, as the water heater is draining, it starts to fill up your nozzle. Hopefully this video was a help in just allowing you to see the insides of a water heater, you kind of understand the inside components, a lot of issues that you run into as far as uh, your water heater being filled with uh, calcium deposits, metal deposits, debris. If this video was a help, if it was informational, please subscribe.